head of the European Union delegation in Uganda. Ambassador Tilio Pasifichi led a team of nine ambassadors for a meeting with the president of the National Interplatform, Robert Chagrani Center more at his home in Magere, Wakiso district. The ambassadors at the meeting were from Germany, France, Italy, the Netherlands, Belgium, Sweden, Austria, Denmark, and Ireland. The NUP principals accompanied by the party vice president for Uganda, Matthias Simpuga, Lina Zedrig of Northern Uganda, NUP Secretary General, Davis Lewis Lubongoya, party spokesman Joel Senyonyi, leader of the Women's League, Flavia Kalena Bagabe, among others. The closed door meeting went on for about two hours. Afterwards, Senyonyi addressed the media and said that NUP emphasized the need for EU countries to engage the Ugandan government to act on human rights abuses against citizens, including abductions and narrowing space for the opposition. We are hoping, we are hoping uh, that it will have some kind of impact. You know that if uh, Mr. Tivuhabura cannot listen to Ugandans who he purports to lead, who give him their hard-earned taxpayer money, to run this country and they're telling him please use our money better deliver services and so on if he can't hopefully he can listen to our friends our development partners our neighbors and sometimes the head of the family will listen to a neighbor that they respect that they hold in high regard that's what we are doing you know as ugandans our leaders are ill-treating us and so we are saying their colleague leaders can reach out to them and tell them what you're doing is wrong they're not saying we want to come and run the affairs of your home or your country for that matter no it's to say this is not proper. The same way we can do that for any other country. Uganda, we can reach out to any country and say, you know what? No, the way you're leading your people is not proper and all of that. Through his Twitter handle, the head of the EU delegation to Uganda, Ambassador Tilio Pasifici, said that they had called for dialogue among political players. He added that the EU will later meet with government officials and other political parties. Uh, and, and we are not actually opposed to an interaction. We're only saying any discussion, any mediation, whatever name you want to give it, should number one be about Ugandans and it should involve Ugandans generally. Not, not two people, like there is anything personal between them because there is not. So, so that's very important. Gently for Mala, NTV News.